How's everybody? Zayd Uncle Figo Kilia. I'm with Sali Tofi. Good evening. Good evening. Good. For, for, for hooking up with us tonight. Sure, man. With you, uh, Isuzu. I have had recent uh, run in with a vehicle that has similar motor mm -hmm. that you've got in. And I never knew there was more than one. <laughs> I thought it was the only one. And then it was brought to my attention by Ali of Thread Butler. Yes, yes, yes. More than one. So, yeah. Sali, just tell us a little what motor you're actually running in this car. Uh, we're running the, the VQ35, which the is commonly known to the 350Z motor. Yes, correct. Yeah. Single intake, which means. Single the intake, correct. Yeah, correct. Um, so, um, you, you've built the stuff all yourself? Yeah, no, we do. That's my, my business, actually. We do conversions and stuff, okay. and uh, we do it turnkey project basically okay you bring your car uh, non-driving and it will leave driving you okay. understand so all the work done to the bucket is done in house by us except exhaust that's okay all. yeah so who do you use for exhaust by uh, exhaust uh, we shout out to to Monet at uh, silencer city okay did an excellent job on the exhaust yeah okay mm. so it's the vq35 we've got uh, what gearbox are you running with this? i'm running currently the zd30 which is the diesel 3 yeah. liter hard bodies gearbox. 3 liter yeah. 16 valve diesel, yeah. Correct, yeah. Which is mm. otherwise commonly known as a fat box. Correct, sir. <laughs> Correct, yeah. So, um, you've got the, the, the three. Now, what what was the, 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 the application that was required or the, the modification required to get the VQ motor to communicate, if you can put it that way, what with the, the CD, CD30 box? Uh, look, basically, the Nissan, uh, through all the years, the stuff normally mates it to each other. Okay. And uh, the CD30 box mated quite well. The only thing was we figured out that uh, the bell housing bolts didn't line up. Okay. So, it was a bit And the cops so was mark a plan. Yeah. <laughs> and then we put our heads together, got a couple of engineers involved, and we made a little extensions to the gearbox. Okay. Had it welded up, and then we got it to work, yeah. Got it to work. Mm -hmm. I know we had a little interesting discussion here under the, the, the canopy. You were talking about the, the distance on the fork. Yeah, no, on the release bearing. Oh, that was a bit of a headache <laughs> to figure out, yeah. Uh, but then um, eventually, you know, uh, struggling and circling, and then we got it right, yeah. We so had to, we had to modify some, the release some, bearing. Some, some R&D research. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, we actually did like four bolts already like this. So, oh, yeah. wow. There's about four, two hard bodies, and I'm currently busy with an E30 as well. E30 with the VQ with, with the VQ in here. You uh -huh. and the VQ35 is getting very scarce now, eh? Yeah, yeah. Now everybody's buying them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so how much power you make, sir? Uh, currently we're like on 231 with 380, and that's on the Zyl at Z line. Okay. At Z line, so your tuning yeah. is done by by Zyl. By Z line, yes, because okay. we're running the power mods, which he specializes in, basically. Yeah, yeah. I oh. have a very long-standing relationship. Yes, with I know Zyl. that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, yeah, so the, your car does pretty well. Have you had it at, at events like robot racing or street to street? I'm, I'm actually not into the racing scene at really? all. Really? Yeah. You I mean, just built this for passion. For passion and like I okay. said, like a bit of a sleeper. So mm. we, no, had, <laughs> we, had some, sleeper. we had some wheels planned and stuff, but okay. then we changed our mind to keep mm. it like a you know, farm truck uh, build, uh, you understand, undercover sleeper type of thing. And so far it's worked out well, yeah. With, uh, Put quite a few big people in uh, in tears and in disbelief, you understand? <laughs> yeah, I've gotten some of the videos <laughs> from Ali. So, uh, mm. you've built this car for passion, not really into the racing. Mm -mm. It, it's a very, very, very understated build, if I can put it that Yeah, way. that was the idea, you understand? That's the that idea. was the idea. Flying under the radar, because yeah, the only person would look at it, it's not a bucket. Yeah, that's it, that's exactly what you were doing. Like, I would say, like, it's a fucked up bucket. I saw it we got the exhaust tips, uh, Mone did an excellent job hiding the boxes away. Okay. So it's very unassuming. I mean, mm. you pull up at the robot, whoop, and everyone looked at Paki Mas. Mm, yeah. You understand? Like don't, like, exactly. Why is it pretty is it? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> but, Sally, I must say, shukran to you. Have fun, brother, man. No very problem. nice build. Cool. Very, very nice. No, uh, we'll look up again with, with some of the other builds and mm. we oh, can see how much, nice. how much we improved. Yeah, it will uh. be very, very good. But yeah, but stay tuned. Hopefully, we're going to go some... Some twin turbos on here, oh. maybe in the future. Wow. Yeah, we need to do some work. Uh, hopefully, my cousin there, Mr. Islands, will be involved here <laughs> as well. <laughs> yeah, so um, just one last thing. I want to look at the camera and point at it and say, hashtag Ragweiss. Hashtag Ragweiss, Owens. Shukran, Lovely, man.